Hey guys, Ravi here from Ira FX and I welcome you to another After Effects tutorial. So let us first have a look at what we're gonna be creating today. Alright, so this is 3D soccer ball animation and it's a beginner's tutorial considering the fact that you know the interface of Adobe After Effects. If you'd like to download this project file, you can download it absolutely free from my website irafx.net and also do check my Patreon account wherein you can get access to um, exclusive visual effects and downloads. So without any delay, let's get started. Let us first divide this tutorial into two steps. Step 1 making the background and step 2 animating our soccer ball. So the first step let us first create a new composition. Let me name this to soccer ball logo reveal or in 1080p format with 5 seconds duration and click OK. So in order to create a background let us create a solid layer new solid and let me name this to background and click OK so from the effects and presets panel type in gradient ramp and drag this gradient ramp effect onto our background so I usually use um, default settings like I use uh, start of ramp to 960 by 40 end of ramp to 960 3000 and I change the end color to a uh, light blue color so the, like this and change this to radial ram and swap the colors so we get a clean texture of a, of a background that we are okay with so the next thing that we have to do is animate a so soccer ball so I have this football map that I downloaded from uh, creative curve for forum so that's a crazy place where you can learn visual effects especially Adobe After Effects so you can also download this from the link in the description that I will put below so drag this uh, football map onto this onto your composition and let me rename this to Ball. and the FX and presets panel if you don't find this FX and presets panel here make sure you check this FX and presets from the window menu and from the FX and presets panel type in CC spear you have this CC spear from the perspective FX and drag this onto our football layer this so now you see that our football map has turned into a soccer ball so let us adjust these settings so that we get a clear image of our soccer ball to expand this light increase this light um, line light height to 80 and increase this shading option here is the ambient to round 50 okay now you have a clear picture here let us increase the radius a bit right and in order to have the soccer ball animated we'll have to increase the rotation click on this timer button here for rotation y at the first frame of the composition and move to last frame and set this value to um, 4 right so 4 into the original rotation so if you start going forward our soccer ball starts rotating long y axis so we, wa we want to animate our soccer ball in such a way that it starts from the right side of the composition 
gets a curve and moves back the right side as seen in the demo that you saw in the beginning of the video so in order to do that let us first turn our football layer into 3d okay increase this um, menu here span the transform and set the position value to uh, use the z axis such a way that it moves back let us move it to the right as well right let's move it a bit top and click on this timer button here so that a keyframe is created at this point so now move to one second forward or one and half second forward and move the x axis to the left such a way that it it is the left side of our composition right and now move to around two and a half seconds forward and increase this that axis value in such a way that it is is moving towards our that axis also move the X axis to the right so that you can see there is a curve happening like so the axis for the more and move to around four seconds four and a half seconds forward and increase the X axis such that our football moves outside our composition just like this now if you start playing this this is how our animation is going to look like all right so you can see that the ball is moving a bit slower towards the end so what i do is simply drag this closer yep that looks good to me perfect the last thing that we have to do is add a logo at this point of time such that our logo gets revealed when the soccer ball moves out so i have this sample logo let me drag this onto my composition let me just scale this a bit so that it fits in the uh, football and right click on the logo and pre-compose it let me call this logo and click O and uh, make sure you move all attributes into new composition and click OK so what we have now is a logo on the top just move it below the football layer and just scale uh, I just uh, trim this logo in such a way that it has to appear when the soccer ball outside our logo kill this one point down this a little like this and now if I start playing this this is how our animation is going to look like perfect this is how you do a soccer ball animation this is how a logo reveal is done as well but after effects is all about creativity so you can use your creativity to to create crazy visual effects or logo animations with this technique yes yep i'll attach this project file just in case you want to download it right away so if you are looking for more visual effects and tutorials consider subscribing to my channel and you can also follow me on Instagram at VFXGuyRavi. See you guys next time with another tutorial.